How many CEOs you know who strap in, eat dust for hundreds of miles while enduring some of the world's toughest races? Well, Greg Adler does. Greg, welcome back to the block. Thanks, Courtney, glad to be back. Now, does it make sense that the head of four-wheel parts climbs behind the wheel of a rock buggy? I'd like to think so. It, it's like my second office, and uh, it's great exposure for four-wheel parts, and so many of our employees are off-road enthusiasts that spend their weekends out there four-wheeling, so I just get to do it on a little bit bigger scale. Greg, last time you were here, you brought your 800-horse Pro 2 race truck. This time, you have your rock crawler. Yeah, the, uh, we still race the Pro 2 short course truck, and it's like a cage fight every time you get into those races. The rock crawler is a lot of fun. It's a, it's a dual sport of, of racing fast through the desert, but getting through some of the toughest terrain you can imagine rock crawling. Tell us about this rig. This thing is a custom tube chassis. It's got a big Chevy LS1 engine, puts out about 550 horsepower, 39 inch BF Goodrich crawler tires to help me get through some of the tough terrain. Big Dana 60 axles with ARB air lockers and Rubicon Express custom suspension to, to really help us tackle that stuff. Now being out there racing with the parts that you sell must give your company quite an advantage. We would like to think so. We really get to go out and use and abuse these parts and see what is working, how it works and, and bring that back to, uh, to the stores and to our, our call center so people can really talk educated about the parts. It goes back to win on Sunday, sell on Monday. Greg, you've raced everything from the Baja short course off-road racing to rock crawling. Those are some high dollar rigs. Yes, they are, but you can take your daily driver and build it up really inexpensively. Like Ian just built that low dollar wheeler. It's a perfect example of a, a daily driver that can be converted to uh, going out and hitting these trails. All you gotta do is go to fullwheelparts.com or stop by any one of our 55 stores to get all these good parts and get you ready to go. Cool. Speaking of that Jeep, it looked awesome. What do you see in the future for regular 4x4 enthusiasts? Just more good stuff. You know, these enthusiasts love to go out and go four-wheel and take their families out and hit the trails, and we just see more and more opportunities to do that and continued growth, so all good. Greg, thanks for being a guest today and for bringing in the killer four-wheel parts crawler. No problem. It was tons of fun.